Hi guys, it is a cool rainy day here in the end times in the paradise of the green mountains in Vermont here at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. It is about 62 degrees here in the green mountains of Vermont somewhere outside of the little town of Moortown. So, uh, this is my little bivouac for the end times. Probably should be cranking up that wood stuff. Anyway, so I just wanted to, to check the weather forecast for the next week. I got a friend from Austin coming up and was just sending her the weather forecast. Okay, starting tomorrow, that's about a week. So in Moortown, Vermont, the highs, Sunday will be 70 degrees, Monday will be 69 degrees, Tuesday 77, Wednesday 79, and Thursday, all right, we hit 80 degrees on Thursday. So, so that's what I have to look for. It will be Thursday before we see a chance of hitting 80 degrees Fahrenheit. So let's go over there up through Siberia to Bratsk, Russia. I believe it was, oh shit, did, did, did Hugh Gizzoli send me this? So anyway, we just heard Moortown, Vermont. So what is the weather forecast tomorrow through Thursday? in Siberia. Tomorrow it will be 82. Then we will hit 86 on Monday. Then we will hit 90 degrees in Siberia on Tuesday. 92 degrees on Wednesday and 92 degrees on Thursday. The lows in Siberia, the lows in Siberia will be about the same temperature as the highs in Vermont. Uh, what am I looking at? Well, 44, I see, is what I can expect in a couple of nights. So there you go. Do your own math and uh, figure out what this means for things like methane bombs and uh, melting Arctic sea ice. 92 degrees in Siberia, but it is one cool cloudy day here in paradise and maybe me and the little dog can finally get us a walk. Every time we try to take a walk, it starts raining again. I heard that Vermont was in a drought and then of course Hambone gets here and ends the drought. Same thing happened in Kentucky. I guess Kentucky was in a drought, so I went to Kentucky and brought the rain with me and so I heard that Vermont was in a drought so I came up here and ended the drought in Vermont. I hope you all appreciate it. Smoke them if you got them but if you're smoking in Siberia don't stand anywhere near a pond or you might explode. Bye guys.